and a happy St. Patrick's Day to you. As we're here on St. Patrick's Day, we're going to be driving some green cars, because that's kind of what I do for holidays anymore. I just try to go with a color theme, because really, how much can you do? We've been over this before. But at any rate, here we are. It is St. Patrick's Day. It's actually St. Patrick's Day Eve as I'm recording this, you know, just so that we can get this out for the day. It's, it's in the evening. I should be in bed, really. In bed would be where I should be. I'm trying to remember what green cars I have, but that's that's what we're going to do. It's, it's going to be a St. Patrick's Day theme here. Not necessarily the best performers. No, no, but what green cars do I have? I forgot I had the custom banshee, but that's a new one, but it's not green. By the way, if I don't find something green before I run out of time, then I get whatever I get. I know I have a green car. That's green. That's green enough. I got my St. Patrick's Day outfit on here. I'm all dressed up. Green enough. And it's not a slow car. So this is actually not a bad thing. Not a bad thing for St. Patrick's Day. Now, I, I'm not going to be able to deal with likes of the, the Italian GTO, necessarily, but we're going to give it a shot because it's St. Patrick's Day. And this car sounds good, it looks good, and you never know. With a little, a little careful driving. Not that I'm going to be driving carefully, but we're going we're gonna to try. I was actually thinking I was going to be going for the Revolter, which should be in there somewhere. But which I think is one of those cars that doesn't make jumps. The Paragon R, no, this is this is nice and green. It's a nice and green car. We're on the wrong side of history here, I think. We're going to have to... Oh, we're here. He has appeared out of nowhere. I'm trying to give you room, Ace. Almost the over-the-top overtake. The tally's gone, but you know we're we're making bold choices back here. Okay, we're gonna let let him take it through there. He's got the handling on me anyway, but I should have some power advantage. I appreciate him driving the old king. Yeah. Okay, well, you rear-ended me. There's nothing I could do there. Hey, he, he pulled it together. It's nice, clean racing. You don't get that very often. Okay, I'm on the wrong side of history here. Got to keep it tight. Now I can get to the outside a little. Swish to the other outside. You'll notice that I'm not being sucked out into another session or... Being told that there's no suitable person to spectate, which was a subject of another one of my more recent videos, which really took off. I guess it's because all the people had that kind of problem, which it was only a, a day or so later that Rockstar came out and said, oh, hey, we, we're aware of this. We're patching it. So that was good of them. Straighten that out, because the game was unplayable for a little while there. And I would have gotten this information to you a little bit sooner. Everybody knows now, but I mean... Uh, I ended up going to a, a funeral in North Carolina, which was a bit of a... A bit of a thing. Not a happy thing, no. We're gonna miss you, Jackie. God bless. 
But at any rate, we're not to dwell on that too much. We're, we're here to race. We're here to unwind a little bit here and talk about recent developments of GTA Online, a game that's many, many, many years old but keeps getting reborn. So that's what's happening now. You've got the, the, the PS5 and Xbox One. What do they even call it now? It's like there was the Xbox One, the Xbox One X, now there's the Xbox One S and the Xbox One si X1. I don't even know anymore. I can't I can't follow what Xbox is doing. But they got they did what was gonna be called expanded and enhanced is now just GTA 5 for that platform, whatever it is. And they've got it added a few cars. I'm a little jealous of the fact that PC isn't at least so far getting the the cross between a Torino and a Buick Skylark of some nature. That that car looks neat. They've added a little bit of a little bit of content to it. All the reports from the field. I'm a PC gamer, so this, none of this affects me. All the reports from the field are that it's really kind of gotten weird with the new cars. That they're really way overpowered. And it's, you know, still limited by traction, but going at speeds faster than anything ever seen before. Which could be interesting and fun in and of itself. Not sure it's going to be good for racing. We'll have to just see how that goes. Does it affect me? Because I'm a PC person. Also, you know, I've been watching mostly... A little bit of Pyrelm, a little bit of Bruffy, a little bit of GTA men. Apparently they've, they've put this permanent motion blur on, which did not necessarily the best thing. It's, it's People are saying it makes them a little nauseous. So, a little dizzy, a little dizzy, a little nauseous. You can, you can turn motion blur on on PC. I have it turned all the way down. Turned off. It's almost like... I mean, this is going to sound like a, a, a typical PC Master Race kind of thing. I guess he wanted to DNF. I don't know. But it seems like they're getting the benefits of all the stuff the PC had with some additional annoyances. Now, they don't have the hackers, but, uh, you know, you take the good with the bad. Best lap, I had second best lap. Okay. We'll give it a like. We'll buy ammo because we almost always need ammo. Interesting that the Paragon R comes up blue even though it looks so green. Must have, I must have a mix of colors on here. Okay, where are we going? What do you think they'll pick? Vespucci? French 1? No, nothing else really calls. I guess we might as well take it. City Air, we just did City Air. Do I have anything green here? Do I still have one of my motorcycles repainted for St. Patrick's Day from the last time I did this? Or is that repainted for Christmas? I can't remember. There's still be green on it. Green and red, though. Eh. It's a lot of them. I didn't really do any like prep work for this other than changing my outfit, so I didn't repaint the Shotaro all green or something. That would work. Next year. Next year. So there's a lot of different little, you know, fiddly aspects to the the expanded enhanced or broken and bugged, depending on, you know, if you uh if you, whatchamacallit, if you transfer your character, it deletes it from the old thing here, from your old account, so you can't have it in two places. I think the only thing I've changed, the chance I got here to go green. Where was it? I'm going to run out of time. Yep. The FCR 1000 custom. Not going to be a top performer by any stretch of the imagination. But, 
still chasing that elusive 400th win. So that's something important to note, but you know, I, as a PC person, you can't transfer from PC anyway. I, I don't know why. I guess they're afraid they'll get a bunch of whole hacked and modded accounts just flooding the PS4 and PS4, well, PS5 rather. Whee! Yeah, I do not have the bike for this race. So it does handle well. I just kicked that guy into oblivion. You have to especially check out Ruffy1322. He's actually testing the new cars even though he can't transfer his old account. At least not yet. So... That's going to be a massive effort because he won't have any money. I don't know what happened there. Some kind of massive lag turbo boost. It's well, you know, the one nice thing about PS5 is you don't have to worry about that happening. I'm guessing. I almost flipped upside down there. Like, I didn't know you could, I, I've never seen a bike you could actually do, like, a backflip on. I think someone landed badly there. Seventh, well, you know. Considering we're going for style points here. On a bike straight out of my Top Gear Grand Tour... Movie's Garage Garage. Because it's something that I thought like Hammond would like. Oh, that guy just got punted in, into the sky. Oh, no! I didn't land right. That little bit of wheelie. Back down the order. It was going so well, too. Top five was possible. I mentioned Richard Hammond and I crashed. Well, there's something to be said for that, I guess. It's... Irony is not lost on me here. It does handle pretty nice, but I think that's because it's not going very fast. Skyward! Outward! And then just land it flat. And we can officially say top five is always possible. Here, throw a little, a little bruffy line out there every once in a while. Yeah, you guys got to check out, check out the, you know, go down to in the description to my GTA library. Check out some of those guys. They're doing a lot of reviews of the PS5 stuff. And I, I notice it's mostly they're looking at PS5, not so much the Xbox stuff. Which, I'm not sure why. It might be just a cultural kind of thing. Or what people own. I mean, you know. Me, I don't own a PS5. Don't own any, I don't own a next-gen console. And if I was going to put that much money down, I'd get a new PC. So, that's that's where I'm at. That's just you know, the lifestyle I lead. So, not covering as much as that. But I, looking at the coverage I've seen, the best I can tell you is I'm happy I'm on PC. I just There's a couple cars I guess will eventually get. Maybe. Who knows? You'd think they'd drip-feed it eventually. Make it exclusive it for a while for the new guys. Let them get set up. Yeah, not... We weren't flying, but we did pretty good for all that. I'm going to vote a bridge too far. They want to do Vijuji. Blank off all toxic pilots. I am 7880 ranked. 
Mondial. Oh, I don't know who that that means. I'd say put it in the comments if you know what that means. But I don't have comments because I set all my videos to kid friendly because I'm afraid, you know, the COPPA Act will will envelop me and the FCC will come and get me and then say you've been showing videos to kids and stealing their information. I'm like I haven't been stealing their information. YouTube's been still stealing their information, but you said it wasn't for kids. It's GTA. It's 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 ranked M for mature. Doesn't matter. Car kids love cars and car crashes. All right, I'll give you that. So it's a video game. It's a game. Games are for kids. You should be serious. I should be sitting in a room full of books right now. Smoking a pipe and reading about Alexander the Great. Instead, I'm playing video games, and I'm happy. I'm good. This is this is all good. Okay, we're gonna. I'm gonna see if I can find the real Irish special here. I mean, I, the, the other the Paragon art is good, but we want to get into. We want to delve into the silly. There it is. The Uber, the, the Custom Revolter. This, this is my uh, St. Patrick's Day special here, folks. All these people, they don't realize they're going to be on the St. Patrick's Day special video. Grab yourself a Shamrock Shake. Or some whiskey or something. Some Irish, some Irish coffee. I don't know. It's non-contact. This is just, yes, it's it's a bit of the green with the gold at the end of the, the rainbow. Yeah, I do not expect this to go well for me. Revolter, not, not necessarily the best. We'll see how it goes. I do like the track, though. Someone's laying on the horn for no reason. All right, we outhandled him. Go Revolter. Look at this baby go. Now the Italians are going to jump in these tubes and take off. I... I love, one of the reasons I love this track is because I usually take the Itali and it just owns here. Wow, look at this revolter fly, though. That, that can't be right. That has to be some kind of mathematically screwed up thing. I'm in second, but someone's right on me. See... See how it's struggling with the jumps? I'm barely making that. There's some weird physics with the revolter that is totally revolting. That would have been a mid-air collision if it wasn't no contact. I wonder, does the revolter benefit a lot from curb boosting through here? Am I like getting some ridiculous amount of speed? Not enough to catch an Itali, but, you know, still. A sick drift going through the turns. Those low rider wheels. Oh, dear. And everybody passes me. Okay, let's see if we can blow through them again. Will the St. Patty Patrick's Day Special. Oh, well, we got another lap. I can't be my personal best. No, it can't. It's not. Maybe the best of the Revolter, but... Coming straight through ya. Why is this going so well? I was a little conservative on that turn, I admit. Because I am in a what? A revolter. I 
That needs maximum brakes on that right there. Whoa! Someone got cute. He should catch up to us. He's in an Itali, so I imagine once he hits the tubes, he'll come flying through. Once you hit the tubes, you come flying through. And once you hit the tubes, you go flying through. Try not to hit nothing, and you'll keep on flying through. I'd like a podium, but I think it's too far. I don't know. There's still another section of tubes here. And if the Revolter has some kind of curb boosting happiness. Yeah, here comes that Itali. I don't know. I don't know if I have enough track left. If there's another lap. Oh man, there's positions right here. Now they didn't screw up the turn, so therefore. That's where I screwed it up last time. Almost screwed it up this time. Yeah, I think fourth is probably gonna be where we end up. But you know, really, realistically speaking, if I hadn't made that one mistake, we'd be right in it right here. Yeah, so I, I kind of let the uh, let the revolter down a little bit there. If we get another chance, we'll take it again, but not on something like Big Drop. It won't finish Big Drop. Currently sipping some caffeine-free Mountain Dew, which is utterly unavailable where I live. But you can get it at the Food Lion down in Welcome, North Carolina, so... flip de doo Yay! Yeah, that's, that's a good final look. If I hadn't screwed up that one time, I think I would have read it. I wouldn't have been in it for the win, but... Would have done better than fourth. Salute to ya! <laughs> Itali GTO, Itali GTO, Itali RSX Revolter! I'm up there with I was I'm pulling RSX I'm pulling almost GTO times I'm just a couple seconds off the GTO, Revolter. What are you, you must be a tube monster. What are we doing next, guys? I'll 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 go with the city limits. I want to do at least one super so I can break out my. Banshee 900R. Which, in PC at least, is still faster than the regular Banshee, but not, you know. Well, you gotta go look, go watch Bruffy stuff. That's interesting stuff over there. Hopefully it's interesting stuff here. You can Watch a bunch. I have bunches of videos. Super catch ups on, customs on, slipstream on. A lot of times I'll get burned because I'm trying to do a theme kind of thing. And then they'll turn customs off. And then I got to do, you know, because, well, let's just pick green. It's not as fancy. And they did. Oh my goodness. They did it to me again. I said it and it happened. All right, what are we taking? If we're not taking the, the Banshee. We're taking something and we're going to make it green. If you want to be like this. <laughs> Customs off. All right, whatever's. They, they've hurt themselves, because now instead of driving a Banshee 900R, I'm going to be driving a Krieger in the brightest green I can find here. Bright green. Continue. Now you're dealing with a bright green Krieger. 
happy now? I'm actually not sure which of these cars is the fastest stock. I mean, I just don't know. Might not be the Krieger, but the Krieger is not a, it's never a bad choice. I think we're still going to be at 399 by the time this evening ends, but I'm going to try. That S, uh, was it the S281 or something? I forget what it is. The one that's like the, the RE7B, only even grippier. That might be the choice for this. Looks like I'm not far off for most things. Somebody picked the car from the thumbnail. Some people know how to do the turbo boost. Others know how to do curb boosts. I missed the, the boost pads on that one. Some do how to do the... Oh dear, we're getting tangled! Oh dear. Oh dear. Well, that was just ugly, but you know. I'm trying to give you room. Give me room. I think he spun out. Trying to give me room. Well, thank you, good sir. That was considerate of you. Now, let's see if the luck of the Irish can get us to a position better than 10th. I see cars tangling. Yeah, it doesn't quite have the grip it does, you know, fully modded, so... Fully loaded, fully upgraded. Fully taken to the auto shop and auto shopped up. But we're gonna do... Oh dear! A little bit of an unsafe re-entry there, but you know, he's trying. Okay, so there's... Ninth base just on somebody else's mistake, and we'll, oh dear, someone's flying off into the into the sunset off that jump. Bye bye and brakes. Okay, we're holding it so far, taking the slip through and in the lap two or two. And we're on the hunt. Yeah, it's a little bit much to take that flat out, but... <sighs> oh dear. I have some grippy cars ahead, so this could be somewhere they'll pull away. And this the the Krieger's no slouch when it comes to curves. That's you know it's it can't be a bad choice ever. Not in my mind. Oh dear. Chaos. Chaos! Okay, now, in my defense, my PC, I believe, turns 7 this month. I think I ordered that. I think I ordered I always remember this because I ordered it in March of, of 2015. Took a massive pay cut in May. After I'd already had the loan for it, because it was, I forget, like, it wasn't quite two grand, I don't think. I mean, it was like 1700 something like that. Those were back in days when you could get, like, video cards, and they weren't ridiculous. <laughs> for the time, I mean, I was building it to, to play Star Citizen. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, we all know how that worked out. Maybe someday. Probably not on this PC. So, yeah, just as I'm, I'm pulling in there, you wouldn't believe the loud brrrr that was like going on in my headphones when, uh, when that crash happened. 
It was really just ugly. Just wiped the computer here. Dude it. But now it's like 20 after 11, and I really need to be getting up in like less than six hours when I'm doing it properly. Oh, I came out here because this car is green. Look at that, it's green. This is a car I don't do enough stuff with. It really is cool. Didn't even know that was an option. Let's do that again. Let's let's hey, go. So let's see, we came up here. Rev it. Handbrake. Pop oh wheeling. That's cool as the first time I did it. And then we got that on. Let's see if we can climb up over this cat. Back up a little bit and then. Ta -da 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 -da! Okay, that Oh, she, it's like, she's just like, what are you doing? Say hello. Let's try it from, let's try it from my, like, here. It, have you picked up that I'm not going to do any more racing? Oh. Yeah, we're we're done here. This thing probably has the most weapons of any four-wheel thing in the whole game. It's just nice. So on that note, ladies and gentlemen, I guess, I guess I'll leave this parked up in the facility. You don't know it never gets used up there. Should put it in here in part of it. It would make a good addition. Kind of set something else up too. I mean, it would make sense to be a facility vehicle. Since I never go to the facility and I have stuff to do here. But let's do that. Let's let's make, move it to the agency. I have a little bit of parking left. And there's again, okay, we can move something else up to the. Uh, do I have parking left? Yeah, there's parking. Not a ton. Well, that was disappointing because I thought things were going well. And look, look at the options we would have had. I mean, we could have, if we got, this would count. It's a green there. Green. Could use that one. And of course, the green bravado. If we ever got a muscle car race, we just clean house with that. Eh. That was my one of the Christmas cars. So at any rate, I guess at, there comes a point when you really should just call it good, right? So happy St. Patrick's Day, everybody. Hopefully you're. Enjoying St. Patrick's Day, the, the, the true sense of love of God and Trinity that St. Patrick would have wanted you to spend the day doing, you know, or at least you're having some kind of fun where you don't damage yourself. Let's hope. That, that's all. That's all I'm going to say. Okay. On that note, ladies and gentlemen, happy St. Patrick's Day, and this is your Black Knight. Have a great night. <laughs>